So tonight, I'm going to be out after a couple of problem foxes. Welcome to the Night Vision Show. So this evening I've got a nice little paid job, um, taking out some foxes that are um, coming into a bit of ground and taking poultry. Uh, I'll be using uh, my usual 260 Remington setup, and with that, firstly I'm going to be spotting using the uh, XP38 thermal spotter from uh, Pulsar and supplied by Scott Country. They're really good little bits of kit that give you the uh, first sign of a fox about, and um, you pick that up straight away. Uh, the other bit of kit I'll be using, sorry I'm just keeping my eye out in case the fox appears while I'm talking to you guys. Uh, the other piece of kit I'll be using is the uh, F155, again from Scott Country. This is a night vision add-on which adds onto the front of your day scope. And uh, that gives you capabilities out to about 200 yards. It's a good little bit of kit though, I like that. And with that, to get the most from it, I'm going to be using a PBIR illuminator. And um, hopefully I'll be able to get you a bit of footage tonight. Now, uh, on this particular bit of ground, I thought it was only probably going to be maybe half a dozen foxes at most. Um, and I, uh, I cleared up um, a couple of vixens, about four cubs, uh, and a dog fox, and I thought well, that's probably a lot. And I came up the next night just to make sure and shot another fox. And a couple of nights later, I shot a couple more, and it kind of went on like that. And it's up to 11 foxes now. Um, I, I think I've dealt with them all now, but... This evening I'm just out just to um, have a little look and uh, make sure I have got all the foxes here. Um, we've got some trail cameras set out as well and uh, hopefully um, they're going to be clear tonight. We've been checking them uh, recently and the last day or two they've been clear. So hopefully that'll carry on and I won't see them tonight and then I'll know the job's done. Or at least for now. Uh, if I don't see them tonight then um, I'll go on to another bit of ground which is just down the road here and um, see if I can find something down there. Again, that's another, another ground that um, quite regularly gets foxes on it. Uh, they always cause a bit of a problem down the farm there. So uh, I'll have a look down there and if the field's been cut then there's a good chance there'll be a fox out on them. After waiting for several hours I was just about to pack up and go home when this little cheeky chappy came wandering along the hedgerow. Hey! With a good sized fox in the bag, I'll move on to another bit of ground to try my luck with a bit of cooling. Hanging the cooler from a spike in the ground, I set the cooler going and wait to see what comes in. In seconds, a fox comes bounding in from the tree line.
Hey! Once again, the Hellion Spotter and the F-155 prove extremely effective on the Foxes.